Today I'm going to teach you a skill that is going to change the way you play and it's called muting. Now the reason that a lot of great players play the way they do is because they're able to successfully not play notes that don't belong in the music that they are playing. So let me give you an example of what happens if you're a beginner. You go to play a chord, let's say you're trying to play a D power chord just like this, right? But instead of just playing those two strings, you hit a bunch of other strings. And that really muddies up the sound of the chord and then it just doesn't sound good. So one of the things that you definitely want to focus on is creating or developing an effective muting technique to the point where you should be able to play one single note and hit all, all six strings and only that one note should be able to bring out. This is a great litmus test and it's also a great way to make an entry into the world of funk guitar playing. So a lot of times you'll hear these little bubble parts that are kind of like And you don't hear everything else. You don't hear all the other strings ringing out because whoever's playing it is successfully muting all the other strings, the other five strings or whatever, what have you. So a great way to get into this is just to start off by just muting every string except the one you wanna play. I recommend starting on the fifth or the sixth fret of the G string, just kind of like, So just one note. So sweep your pick across every note and make sure that only one note is ringing out. And then over time, you're gonna be able to employ that technique anytime you wanna play. So a good example of this is John Frusciante playing Can't Stop, the great, the RHCP song uh, that goes where he's playing single notes over there, but he's hitting all these strings. So that is one of the most crucial, most important skills that you can develop if you're a beginner to intermediate player and you're having this problem of like hitting a string and then everything else ringing out. So yeah, I hope that helps. Have some fun with it. And uh, if you have any comments or questions, drop them below and I'll get back to you. I'll see you soon.